All you'll need are some long nose pliers and a Phillips screwdriver. Firstly, switch off the power and unplug from the wall. Then lift up the catches. You should be able to do this by hand, but you may need some pliers if they're stiff. Remove the door by continuing to close it whilst pulling it upwards at the same time until it's released. Then remove all of the oven shelves. Depending on your oven model, there will likely be four screws holding down the back plate. You'll need to remove these and then take away the back plate. We'll then see the element which circles the fan. This is normally held down by three screws, two at the top and one at the bottom. Unscrew these. We recommend taking a photo of the existing wiring just so you have a reference if needed. Unclip the connectors by hand or using a pair of long nose pliers. Be careful not to lose the wires down the back of the oven. If you do, you'll just need to gain access to the back and push them back through. Then simply clip the wires to the connectors as per the previous oven element. The element will then go into the back of the oven and the three screws can be refitted. You can then reattach the back plate and refit the final four screws. Pop your oven shelves back on and then finally reattach your oven door and ensure the latches are pushed down and closed properly. And that's it, you're all sorted. Plug your oven back in and you'll be up and running.